Hi all. Hope you are doing well. Today here, you will see how to create a stylish business card PSD mockup in Adobe Photoshop, and amazingly, in less than 5 minutes. Some of the Photoshop shortcuts are used, which you can see, at the bottom of the video screen, as and when they are used. Following the process you will be able to use and create your own smart objects PSD mockups and present your business card designs in an appealing styles. Ok let's start. This is the image, we will be using to create our stylish business card mockup. You can download the source PSD mockup file of the tutorial, from the URL given in the description of this video, and free of cost. Now, in the layers panel, name this image layer as the background. Using the rectangle tool from the toolbar, click on the canvas, and a dialog box will appear. Giving the standard US business card dimensions, insert values 3.5 inches in width, and 2 inches in height. Hit OK, a rectangle shape of business card size created for you. This will serve as our business card front. Change the color of the rectangle to, white from the, colors panel. Now, right click, on the rectangle layer, in the layers panel, and click on convert to smart object. Name the layer, business card front. Double click on the smart object, it opens a tab window for you. Here right, front. Choose any font you like. Adjust the size. And align to center. Press Ctrl plus S, to save the tab window work, and close the window. You will see your text appears on the card. Do the same process, to create another rectangular shape using the same dimensions, that will serve as our business card back. Right click on the layer, and click on, convert to smart object. Name the layer to, business card back. Double click the smart object layer of card back, in the tab window, right, card back, make it align to center. Save, and close the tab window. Now, we will make these cards, in such a way, that it will align, with the card's shapes, in the background image. To do this, select the front card layer, go to Menu, Edit, click on, Transform, then, Distort. Our card front shape has shown, four anchors, in its four corners. Zoom in and click on each of the anchor, and drag it towards the corners of the front card shape, of the background image. Make it in exact alignment, to that of the cards in the background, by zooming in more.
Once done, hit enter. Do the same for back card shape. Make a distort transform and align each corner with the background's back card shape. Move the front card layer, to top of the layers panel, by dragging it up, so the front card can be seen, on top of the back. Our stylish business card PSD mockup is now ready. We just need to add some effects, to make it look more realistic. Select the, back card layer, in the layers panel, and go to menu, filter, move to, blur, then, Guashion Blur. In the dialog box, use the radius, 4 pixels. Hit, OK. Right click, on the back card layer, in the layers panel. Use, blending options, to set some, gradients. Use, light gray and white, color combination. Set the blend mode. Multiply, and opacity to, 50%. Hit, OK. Now again right click on the back layer, click on, copy layer style, then right click, front layer, and select, paste layer style. Again right click on the, front card layer and select, blending options, in the dialog box, click on, drop shadow, in the properties. Set the settings in a way, that we have subtle shadow on the direction, where it is back of the card located. Now, finally we have the stylish cards ready to present the business card designs. Double clicking, the back card layer, in the tab window, hide, the white background layer. Make the color of the text to, white. Save, and close the tab window. You notice the changes, on the back card. Do the same of front card layer, double click on smart object, hide background layer, and change text color to, white. Save and close the window. Here you will notice two things. The drop shadow, now appears on the text front, instead of the card. Fix this, by disabling the, drop shadow beneath, the front card layer, in the layers panel. The second, you see that, text, back, overlaps the front of the card, which it should not has to be. To fix this, select a, polygonal lasso tool, from the toolbar, and start creating a selection, around the front card where it overlaps the back card.
when the selection is made. Make the selection inverse using menu, select, inverse. Now, select the, business card back layer in the layers panel, and click on, add vector mask, button on the bottom of layers panel. It adds a mask and, the contents of the back card don't overlap now. We are ready to add some real contents of business cards. We can directly add the contents without the background, to let it use the original blue background, later in, we will add contents, with the white background, to see how it looks. Double click, the back card layer, smart object, to open, the tab window. I am using Adobe Illustrator to copy the business card contents of Creative Alleys. Selecting the logo, Ctrl plus C to copy. Switch to Photoshop, Ctrl plus V to paste. Adjust the size, and alignment. Hide the previous text. Save, and close the tab window. You noticed, the back card text replaced to the logo, and it really looks gorgeous. Switch to Illustrator, select, and copy the social media icons and their contents. Go the Photoshop. Double click, on the smart object, of front card layer. In the tab window, paste the content. Align, and adjust. Hide the earlier, text layer, save and close the window. You can see how nice it looks. As we have more space on the card, we can add icons, and text separately, to present them in a more better way. Again, double-click the front card layer, and remove the icons. Switch to Illustrator. Copy the icons, and paste in Photoshop. Add text to icons, adjust, and align them, to get a nice look. Once done, save, close the tab window, and you will amaze to see the stylish results. Now, we have to see how it looks, if we use a white background for the card. To do this, we create a full-fledged business card front. Switch to, Illustrator, and we will use Creative Alley's business card. Select the design element, on the right side of card. Make a copy, switch to Photoshop. Double click, the card front smart object, paste it here as smart object. Set it on, right side of the card. Enable the white background layer. Switch to Illustrator, copy the logo, paste in Photoshop. Set the position to top left. Switch to Illustrator again, copy, 
name, title, and paste, in Photoshop. Now, adjust the social media icons, and their associate content. Make them small in size. Change content text, to black. Once you have nice adjustment of your card, save the work and close the tab window. And an appealing look is awaiting you. See how your business card looks stylish. With the white background, you can now enable the drop shadow of the front card. Yes, it looks great now. Wow. Thank you for watching this video and enjoy creating similar mockups now by your own or use this PSD mockup to represent your business cards in a stylish way. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Visit www.creativealleys.com for more free graphic design resources.